Hi everybody, welcome! My name is Phoenix. And my name is Zephyr. And today we're going to be reviewing the handheld powerful pet dryer by the company called Jellyfish. Zulu, are you ready to unbox your little handheld powerful pet dryer? Okay guys, so let's unbox this handheld powerful pet dryer by Jellyfish. So this is what the packaging looks like. The sides, the back, the other side. Um, so yeah, let's unbox this. Okay, so the first thing, it looks like we have this user's guide or direction manual. Um, very neat. It's got everything you're gonna need to know in English and in other languages as well. So yeah. Then um, over here we've got the um, like quick start kind of instruction. So this is basically it's got all the images. Um, tells you what you need to do in case you forget. Like you know, it's kind of nice actually because personally I'm a you know, visual learner, so this really helps. Um, yeah, so this is the quick start. And then this looks like the main um, hair dryer piece. It's already got the cord attached to it. Um, this is what it looks like. It's got like little gripping pads on the side, which I like. Um, Looks like this is where you attach the nozzles. Um, and these are the two buttons. So this is how you turn it on um, and off and also like how to get the higher speed setting. And then this right here is like the button for um, different, you know, temperatures. So I think there's four of them. And there's like gonna be like a little light that shines that'll tell you which one you're on, which is nice. Um, so yeah, this is the main hair dryer part. And then we have the three different blowing nozzles. So there's this one. Then there's this one. And then the last one is right here. Very nice, very straightforward. Okay, so you just got out of the shower and now we're gonna test this hair dry on Zulu to see how she likes it. Oh, you like that? That's not so bad. 
So now you press this button again. Whoa, now it's a darker orange button. So now it gets a little warmer, maybe. What about that? Yeah, that, that can get a little hot if you leave it on too long in one spot. So if you move it around... And she has really short hair, so she dries pretty quickly. Ooh, it also, if it gets too hot, if you're too close, you gotta be a little bit further away, maybe. Still a little wet. Right underneath there. How's that? Now Zuno has short hair, so she can dry really quickly. But I have long hair, and I would like to see if this blow dryer works on me too. was pretty good. I mean, I really liked how there were different settings for like how fast the um, air is coming out of the nozzle. Um, like there's like a lower setting and then a higher setting, which is nice for dogs that have maybe thicker hair or thinner hair, shorter hair. Um, I also like how there's four different temperatures. Um, so that way, like if your dog's sensitive to heat, you can go with the lower settings and then if you know your dog has really thick hair and like the lower settings just aren't doing the job you can go up higher so uh yeah i really like that i will say however that um zulu was a little bit like afraid of the blow dryer at first because when you turn it on it kind of sounds like a vacuum cleaner a little bit and she hates the vacuum cleaner um so you're definitely going to want to try and like ease into it or you know start them at a young age that way they do get used to it and when they are doing good when you're using the hair dryer you can give them praises and give them treats so zephyr um what did you like about the hair dryer I liked how there were three different blowing nozzles and each one has air that flows through it differently. Yeah, I'd say that's a really nice um, thing too that they incorporated with the hairdryer. So yeah, that's pretty much the end of our review for the handheld powerful pet dryer by the company called Jellyfish. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Goodbye everybody! Say goodbye to the camera.